Santorini is thought to be one of the possible locations for Atlantis. This is likely because historians have noticed the Minoan settlement of Akrotiri, discovered on the island of Santorini, was a developed settlement that was destroyed around 1500 BC due to the strong eruption of the Santorini volcano matching the myth of Plato. Hello everyone. This is AWZ News. In this episode, we are traveling to Greece. Santorini. Stay with us until the end. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon. Santorini. Santorini, officially Thera in classic Greek Thera, is an island in the southern Aegean Sea, about 200 kilometers, 120 miles southeast from the Greek mainland. It is the largest island of a small, circular archipelago, which bears the same name and is the remnant of a caldera. With a surface area of approximately 73 square kilometers, 28 square miles, and a population of 15,550 according to the census completed in 2011, it is the Cyclades Island that is located the farthest to the south. The municipality of Santorini includes the inhabited islands of Santorini and Derasia, as well as the uninhabited islands of Nea Kamini, Palaia Kamini, Aspranasi, and Christiana. There are a total of 90.623 square kilometers, 34.990 square miles of land. Santorini is part of the Thera Regional Unit. The island was the site of one of the largest volcanic eruptions in recorded history, the Minoan eruption, sometimes called the Thera eruption, which occurred about 3,600 years ago at the height of the Minoan civilization. The eruption left a large caldera surrounded by volcanic ash deposits hundreds of meters deep. It is the most active volcanic center in the South Aegean volcanic arc, though what remains today is chiefly a water-filled caldera. The volcanic arc is approximately 500 kilometers, 300 miles long and 20 to 40 kilometers, 12 to 25 miles wide. The region first became volcanically active around 3 to 4 million years ago, though volcanism on Thera began around 2 million years ago with the extrusion of desitic lavas from vents around Akrotiri. History of Santorini It is believed that the first human presence on the island of Santorini dates back to the Neolithic period. This is based on research and excavations conducted on the island. Santorini hosted an important civilization around 3600 BC. Discoveries made in an important city near Akrotiri and the famous Red Beach showed the existence of an ancient Minoan colony. The city was very similar to those found on the island of Crete, like Knossos, with many wall ornaments and pottery showing naturalistic landscapes of animals and humans of the same ancient Minoan style. In ancient times, Santorini Island was known as Strongyli, which means round in Greek. In the year 1500 BC, an enormous volcanic eruption destroyed the Strongyli settlement. Due to the magnitude of the eruption, many people believe that it was the primary factor that led to the demise of the great Minoan civilization on the island of Crete, which is located approximately 70 nautical miles away. The specialists believe that the explosion was so strong that it created gigantic waves that reached the shores of the surrounding islands and Crete. After the explosion, the center of Santorini sank, and the many earthquakes that followed destroyed a big part of the rest of the island. Many studies and researches have been presented in our days about the volcano of Santorini, including a series of documentaries in the National Geographic. In some ancient myths, the destruction of the island is closely associated with the legend of Atlantis. According to history, Phoenicians settled on ancient Thera around 1300 BC and stayed for five generations. After that, sometime around 1100 BC, the island was settled by Lacedaemonian people. Around the year 825 BC, the people who lived on the island, which was back then known as Thera, started using the Phoenician alphabet. In the 7th and 6th centuries BC, Thera had commercial and trade relations with most of the islands and cities of Greece. 
During the Hellenistic period, Thera, because of its central position in the Aegean, became an important trade center and an important naval base due to its strategically perfect position. Between 1200 AC and 1579 AC, the island was under Byzantine rule and the Church of Episcopi Gonia is founded. In 1204 AC, the island is surrendered to the Venetian Marco Sanudo and becomes part of the Duke of the Aegean. The Venetians gave the island its name, Santa Irene, after a Catholic church of the same name that is located on the island. During that time, there are strong battles between Venetians and pirates. The island was able to successfully develop its trading relationships with the ports of the Eastern Mediterranean while it was under Turkish rule, 1579 to 1821. The period that follows is quite prosperous. Due to the wars of the 20th century, Santorini's economy declines and the inhabitants abandoned the island after the catastrophic earthquake in 1956. The tourist development in Santorini begins in the 1970s and today it is one of the best tourist destinations in the world. Over the years, Santorini has also developed as a wedding and honeymoon destination, while many international meetings and conferences take place there in summer, at the Namikos Conference Center or in luxurious hotels. 8 Interesting Facts About Santorini 1. Name Origin During the Neolithic era, the island was called Stromboli, meaning of round shape. Years later, the island's name was changed to the Caliste, meaning the most beautiful one, and then, after the Greek independence, it was referred to as Thera after its capital city. The name Santorini is a contraction of the words Santa and Irene from the name of the old cathedral in the village of Parisa. Although, Thera remains the official name of the island. 2. Residents According to the 2011 census, the population of the island is 15,550. This local population expands in the summer months especially in the peak time of July and August. But despite its few residents, over 2 million tourists are estimated to visit Santorini each year. 3. Number of Churches as is the case throughout all of the islands of the Cyclades, Santorini is abundant with more than 600 temples of all shapes and sizes. Although most of them are quite small, it is believed that there are more churches than residential houses on the island. A lot of them are also private. 4. The Caldera Another interesting fact about Santorini is that the Caldera of Santorini is the only one inhabited caldera in the whole world. It is one of the few places on Earth where cave houses and architectures are preserved on volcanic soil, making it one of the most unique places on the planet. 5. Wine Varieties In proportion to the size of the island, Santorini is the only place on the whole planet with so many wineries. Nine indigenous grape varieties are cultivated, including the famous Assyrtico, the most sought-after Greek wine. Actually, there is so little rain on the island during the year, that wine is more abundant than water. 6. The Lost Atlantis Santorini is thought to be one of the possible locations for Atlantis. This is likely because historians have noticed the Minoan settlement of Akrotiri, discovered on the island of Santorini, was a developed settlement that was destroyed around 1500 BC due to the strong eruption of the Santorini volcano matching the myth of Plato. 7. Hot Springs The island of Nea Kemeni, also known as the Santorini volcano, is a volcanic island at the center of the impressive Santorini caldera. Nea Kamini is surrounded by warm dark waters which are known for their therapeutic benefits. The healing waters of Nea Kamini consist of iron and manganese which act against many diseases that older people usually suffer from. 8. Volcanic Rock The entire island of Santorini is made up of a rock that was formed by volcanic activity. It has taken thousands of volcanic eruptions for the island to be formed. In the last 400.000 years, the Santorini volcano had erupted over 100 times. Due to its volcanic nature, you can enjoy spending time on multicolored beaches during your holidays. 
There are the famous Red Beach and also black and white beaches. This is all for now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon.